A total of 18 schools are here at the National Stadium today for the Over Delhi Thompson Zone of Napsat 2020. And despite some early morning showers, the sun is out and the atmosphere is building. The students and the parents are here are loving it. And we spoke to some parents and teachers from the Elliott Belgrave Primary School who are defending champions in boys and St. Catharines who are the defending champions in the girls section. Have a look. So I'm now here with Miss Taylor uh -huh. from the St. Catharines Primary School. Uh -huh. Miss Taylor, how are you enjoying Napsat 2020 in the Oba Delhi Thompson Zone? Great! How are we enjoying this? Great! <laughs> how happy are you to be back at the stadium? Extremely happy on a scale of 1 to 10, 12. <laughs> How happy are you with the performance of your, your school today? I'm good. I'm good. I'm great with it because we're a very small school. We don't have a lot of practice session. And we're here defending our girls' title. We're doing pretty well because right now I think we're leading in the girls and tied third in the boys. Last time I heard. Do you think that you can go all the way and win? Oh, yeah, you have won double, double champion, yeah. Yep, let's take relays. What can happen in the relays? We've been in all. Oh. Well, 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 the vets will say, Catherine's we can tell. Take the legs like peas. Who are you backing for Napsat 2020? St. Catherine's. Why? Why? The from St. Philip. So we're Philippines, so we're back in St. Catherine's. How do you feel to be back at the National Stadium? Hmm. <laughs> That's a touchy subject. We get wet too much. There is no tents. I got wet. This is not good enough. I thought this was under renovation. This ain't good enough. What do you think about it? And do say we national stadium. This is our national stadium. This is where the young children are supposed to be training to get a career in Carifta and what's not. They need to do something about this thing. This is not good enough. If we revamp the track, you happy with the we track? We glad for it. Glad for it. Mr. Herbert, the acting senior teacher at the Elliott Belgrave Primary School. You guys are defending champions in the boys. <laughs> How do you feel to be back at NAPSAT 2020? I think it's great to be here. Um, to represent the school and to defend the title. We have put in some work with the students, although sometimes the rain caught us up and the weather. But for this meet, I think that we have to do our best. I don't think we have the manpower like last year. So we have a new crop of athletes, so we have to blame them now. So I think in the coming years, we should be able to reach back up to the top among the boys. As I said, we have some repeated young athletes now, which we've seen already. And then there are some budding ones, which we have to put in some extra work with them to come back up. No Jamario Mack this year. He's at the Alexander School in first form. How big of a miss is he? That's a great, that's a great uh, miss. He was a great asset to the, the school there and then. But as you will see that most of those students who would have participated in the under 13 um, division, that division, they have already gone on to the school. So I've gone on to secondary school. So I think that that is one of the areas which today is actually showing up that we have to work on to fill back in our reach. Other than that, I am satisfied that throughout the, the meet so far and the events that the students, the participants have already, they're doing their best, as I would say, at this point in time. But they're young and they need to develop. And if we can get them developing with the help of the coaches and so on, I think that there's still time for us to come back and get up to the top. You think that you can go on and be overall champions? Um, today it's going to be a very tough um, meet. And um, from what I've seen so far, I would say that I don't think that we are going to be um, champions again because of what I have observed so far. And I'm hearing in terms of the point standing um, so far. It's going to be very difficult for us. 
to be crowned this year, but maybe in the year to come or so, we may get back up there. So I will concede that the, um, we have young athletes, they're now being trained, they're now yearning, and I think that we have to give them full credit for their performances today, and also we have a young um, teacher, a young physical education teacher, and she has done her best to, um, along with the management team that they have, put them in place to put these athletes and groom them as they are. So we are we're still competitive and we will continue to be competitive in this area, this field of um, athletics, because it is one channel which all the students love and they want to participate and represent the school and that's and the community as we have here with the parents and so on with the support PT here everybody joining together to raise them I think we will in the future come back thank you so much Mr. Herbert thank you very much